I was standing back there thinking about how determination can pay off. I got a phone call yesterday. It's a little springy outside. Not quite exactly there yet, but with the hope and anticipation that it's arriving. My friend called me and said, my husband dragged the round pen. It looks awesome. Does your daughter want to ride? And I said, Jenna, you want to ride? Yes! <laughs> so we jumped in the car and ran down the bottom of the hill and got the pony out. And uh, he's about this tall, I guess, 750 pounds of old cantankerous pony. And he's put on a little weight over the winter, so he's a little heavier than he used to be. So we get him all tacked up, and we're heading to the round pen, which is probably 500 feet from the barn, give or take. And you can see it. He can see it. And we decide we're just going to go. We get about three feet, and he slams into me with all of his weight, and he's going back to the barn. <laughs> of course, not going to let that happen because I'm not going to let him win. <laughs> so we wrestle down to the round pen. Well, we didn't quite get there, and, and I was starting to get frustrated. So I handed him off to my friend who owns the thing. And she almost got knocked down, so I had to take back over. And I'm like, all right, I got my kid who wants to ride. You're going to the round pen. <laughs> so basically, I backed the little fella up. He wouldn't go forward, so I said, you're going backwards. You're going. We're getting there. And we got there about four feet at a time. <laughs> and he'd knock into me, and we'd circle around and go back and go back and go back and go back. And uh, finally got him to where he would walk forward a little bit. And uh, we'd go about four steps, and I'd make him stop. And four more steps, and make him stop. My friend said, why don't you just get there? You're almost there. And I said, no, I'm going to do it. We're going to win this thing. <laughs> and uh, we got him in the round pen, and we're working him a little bit. And he's trying all kinds of things because he just doesn't want to be there. He wants to be up at the barn where his friend is, in the, where it's nice and warm and his hay and fresh water are. And... Uh, so I just kept working him, and he'd try to turn around, and I'd turn him back around. And long story short, by the time Jenna got on, she had probably the best ride that she's ever had on this cantankerous, pudgy little pony. <laughs> and it's all because of determination. Right. And I was thinking that sometimes we look at a situation and think, I don't know if I can get here from there and still be in one piece. But if you use determination and you stick with the Lord and know that he's on your side, you can push through anything that may be pushing back against you and know that once you cross that threshold and you get in through that gate, you've got the victory right there. And you've gained it every step of the way by continuing to push back and push forward. Not push back, but push forward and push through the obstacle in front of you. There's a, term, a determination to see that you move forward and you gain that victory. And uh, I just thank God for the determination to walk with him and to go with him. And soon and very soon, we're going to see the king because we're not giving up this fight. And there are some times where you face an obstacle and it may look little tiny. But when it starts pushing on you, you realize, you know what, I'm just going to push back and I'm going to win. Because it's not worth turning around for this little thing that stands in front of me. I have a purpose, I have a goal, and I'm going forward, and I made it. And I can say that tonight, that I have a goal, and I have a purpose, and I am going to push forward, no matter what stands in my way, if it's 90 feet tall, if it's 750 pounds, or if it's this tiny little pebble that I keep slipping on. I'm going to get over it, going to get past it, going to get through it, and going to go forward and get the victory. Because God is good, and I'm thankful that he is determined to see us through. And I'm determined to stick with him, because I know where he's brought me from, and I don't want to go back. My eyes are focused forward on the prize, and his name is Jesus Christ. Amen. God is truly good.